Your teacher today is Dr. Bosa Science. Today we are going to study geography. Paper 2. The topic is population distribution, growth, characteristics and problems in selected regions in the world. Part 1 of 2. Population refers the number of people living in a certain area or region at a given time. The total number of people is established by carrying out a population census. A population census is the physical counting of people in the country after a given period of time. In Uganda, Population census is carried out every after 10 years. Importance of population census. 1. It helps to determine the total population size and its distribution in the country. This is important for the national planning purposes. It helps to determine the population growth rate of a country over time. This helps to put in place control measures to regulate the rate of population growth. Population figures are used in the calculation of per capita income of a country. This gives the indication of the standards of living. It helps determine the sex composition of the population, that is, the ratio of men to women. It helps to show the geographical distribution of the population. This is important for regional resource allocation. It helps to determine the rate of internal and external migration. This enables the government to come up with measures to control migration of people. It helps determine ethnic and religious composition of the population. That is, the ratio of the population which belongs to different tribes and religion. It helps to determine the population density, the number of people per unit land. This is used as a basis for demarcating districts for effective service delivery and the constituencies for political purposes. It helps determine the population structure, composition in terms of age and the levels of education. The age structure indicates the number of dependents in the country. It is used to determine occupation composition of the population. This is important for proper manpower planning. Terminologies used in the population. Demograph. This is the study of the population structure and its composition in terms of age, sex, education levels, and so on. Population explosion. This refers to the rapid increase in the population of a given area relative to available resources. Population explosion leads to overpopulation in the long run. Migration. This refers to the movement of people from one area or region to another in a given time. Emigration refers to movement of people which involves entering into a country from another country or a region from another region. Emigration refers to the movement of people out of the country to settle in another country. Factors which influence migration of people. One, imbalances in the resource distribution. 
among regions and countries. People move from countries with low resource distribution to countries with high resource distribution. Differences in the level of development between regions or countries. People move from regions of low development to regions of high development. Differences in incomes and wages between regions and countries. People move from regions of low income or wages to regions of high income and wages. Political stability is like a was. People move from regions of political stability to region of political stability. Educational requirements where people are forced to go to other countries to acquire education. Six differences in climatic conditions, which may be favorable or unfavorable. Seven diseases, which may affect certain regions, thereby pushing people to other regions. Crude birth rate. This refers to the number of children born alive in a year per thousand of the population. It is expressed as a percentage. Crude birth rate is equal to the number of alive born babies over a thousand times 100 percent. Death rate, crude death rate, this refers to the number of deaths in the area per thousand of the population. Crude death rate is equal to the number of deaths divided by 1,000 times 100 percent. Natural population growth rate is the difference between the number of live births per thousand of the population and the number of deaths per thousand of the population in a year. NPGR is equal to live births minus deaths over 1,000 times 100 percent. Artificial population growth rate. This is the population growth rate resulting from net international migration. That is the difference between immigration and emigration. The actual population growth rate is equal to CBR minus CDR plus net international migration. Determinants of population growth rate. Birth rates, death rates, immigration, and the four immigration. Another population terminology is dependence burden. Dependence burden is a situation where there is a big proportion of non-working population depending on a small portion of working population. Dependence ratio. Dependence ratio refers to the ratio of non-working population to the working population. Dependence ratio is equal to the number of dependents over the number of working population or the buffers times 100 percent. O is equal to younger dependents plus all the dependents over working population times 100 percent. The younger dependents are people below 18 years. The old dependents are people above 65 years. Active working group is 18 to 65 years. Another population terminology is fertility rate. This is the average number of live children born per fertile woman. For Uganda's case, it is six children per woman on average. Population distribution in the world. Population distribution refers to how a country's population is spread over 
diunity land area. The distribution of world these population is uneven. Densely populated areas in the world include Western and Central Europe, especially Britain, Germany, France, and so on. East and Central Northern America. The Indian subcontinent comprising of India, Pakistan, Bangladesh, Sri Lanka. The Eastern Monsoon Asia that includes China, Japan, Korea. The Nairobi Valley and Nairobi Delta. The populated areas in the world include South and Eastern Europe, foothills, intermountain basins, plateaus, and grasslands. Sparsely populated areas in the world include hot deserts, for example, Sahara Desert, cold deserts, for example, Northern Canada, hot and wet forests. For example, Amazon, Congo, and its highly populated areas in Africa include West Africa along the coastal regions, south of the Sahel, Ethiopian highlands, highlands of Rwanda and Burundi, the Lake Victoria Basin, the South Africa coastal areas the narrow valley of Egypt, the coast of Mediterranean Sea in the North Africa, urban areas, for example, Cairo, Alexandria, Lagos, Nairobi, Kinshasa, Johannesburg, and so on. The moderately populated areas in Africa include Savannah region of Africa, the low populated areas in Africa include the Sahara region, the Sahara, the Namibia and the Kalahari Desert, the Horn of Africa, Northern Kenya, the Nika Plateau and Central Tanzania. Population distribution in selected countries. Egypt. High population is concentrated along the Nairo Valley, along the Nairo Delta, urban centers along the Mediterranean coast, some areas on the shores of the Red Sea and Sahara Desert oasis. Low population in the rest of the country, such as Sahara Desert. In Nigeria, high population is located in the southern Nigeria, major cities, Yoruba land in the southwest, the Central Jews Plateau, and so on. The moderate population is located in the northern part of Nigeria, for example, around Sokoto, Kano, and Kastan. Areas of low population density include the middle belt. In Kenya, high population occurs along Kenya Highlands, Lake Victoria Basin, coastal plains from Marine to Mombasa, and within major cities. Moderate population occurs in areas like Erigoni area, Nakuru, Kitale, and so on. Low populated areas include Turkana region in northern Kenya, Rift Valley, Masai steppes. It is in China, the highest concentration of people is in eastern China with a density over 200 persons per kilometer squared. 
moderate population is in the southern areas, central areas with a population density of 50 to 100 persons per kilometer square. Sparse population is found in the northern and western part of the country where the density is below 20 persons per kilometer square. In Canada, high population occurs in the southern part of the country. The northern part is sparsely populated due to coldness. In India, the dense population occurs in the Kujarat Plain, Mashatra, New Delhi, Malaba Coast in the south and so on. Sparse population occurs along the Himalaya mountain system and the northeastern part of India.